Wednesday, 12th of September. Me and Jamie are just packing the bikes away here in the boxes. We've already got a. Uh, it's Jamie's bike is in the box. Meta's bike is in the box. Now we're just doing mine. And uh, you have to let the air out the tyres when you fly. And then uh, my bike's lucky. I've got uh, these things here where you can split the bike in two. So just uh, disconnect those. The bike splits in two and then it goes in the box. That's quite easy, really. So uh, that's what we're doing. Putting them in the boxes and then they're ready to, ready to go. When we've done that, then maybe we'll go out and see something in the town. <laughs> <laughs> well, my bike is now <laughs> split in two pieces. That's the benefit of having these uh, S&S couplings on the bike. That's uh, quite good when you need to fly. Makes it much easier to put them in a box. This to here, and you just run, run. You just do this, and so you click them off. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. It's easy, yeah. Yeah. Okay, so bikes are. Uh, in the boxes, well crammed in the boxes, boxes aren't too big but we managed in the end and while we've been uh, putting the bikes in boxes you can see where Meta's been Hairdresser, <laughs> new colour to cover the grey hairs <laughs> <laughs> So yeah, now we're... Uh... And I have a cold Yes, cold for me Yes, <laughs> yeah. not nice but, uh, Yeah, we're gonna have a little bit of lunch and then we'll go and see if we can see a little bit look around the town a little bit So. And then we heard that tonight is curry night in an English pub. So that sounds too good to miss out on. So we'll get ready for India with a nice English pub curry. Good. That so, is good for me. Yeah. It's very good. That's the basic plan. Okay, let's go. This is our lunch today. And now he's chopping the kebab. Now turned into our regular lunch spot. Let's go here and have a kebab. We can get ice cream there. <laughs> it's extremely cheap. All the other countries we've been to, people don't seem to take any notice whatsoever of pedestrian crossings. But here they seem to uh, seem to stop. Notice you if you're standing at the side of the road and the car stop. I haven't seen that anywhere else in Central Asia. Yeah, there we are. Arrived on the main high street here in Almaty. Wow, is even a Starbucks? Looks like that will be the first stop. <laughs> you heard that from <laughs> a couple we met there. Uh, I don't know, at least 10 days ago or more than that, maybe 15 days ago, we met somewhere else in Kyrgyzstan. That I actually live here in Almaty and they said there's a Starbucks coffee. So now we'll try that. <laughs> <laughs> I got a crazy, crazy, crazy idea for you, baby, baby. It's important to all travelers, but it's good coffee. So just stop, I love you, Blake. Got no time for hesitation. Let's get lost. Okay, that was the most important part of the day. Now it's just time for having a look around Almaty. Let's go and see what Almaty looks like. So, uh, if it is as modern as we've heard it, it's supposed to be. There's quite a few green parks as well in the city. It's just one of them. Should be a church a little bit further. The path here. Yeah, so this church is in the center of the park. It's called Zenko's Cathedral. Looks like it's in a state of renovation. It's uh, quite interesting now. Some beautiful colors up there. Okay. So this is what it looks like. It's uh, well before the renovation, maybe. Quite interesting. Never seen such a church, church with so many colours. That's the inside of the church. There's some large posters that are set up outside. That we can look at here. Okay, it's a shame. Uh, this has been renovated. It's quite an interesting church to see in real life. If you. It was all finished. It's also the winter. It's beautiful. Look at all this green and flowers. We 
really, really miss seeing that at some point in Uzbekistan <laughs> and East Iran. Oh, we wanted to see something green. Look at this. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, here it's very green. Fantastic. And twice as far away from home as Iran. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it looks like we're twice as close to. See they're working hard to repaint the surfaces. It'll be beautiful to see when they're finished with this. Now if anybody comes here in a year or two, it must be an amazing sight. Okay, we saw uh, spring come to life in Greece and now we're seeing uh, the autumn start here in uh, Almaty. Not much, but it's just starting to see the first leaves on the floor now and the trees turning yellow. And a few days we'll probably be in the heat again in India. Yeah, with shorts on again. <laughs> And I'm sorry that I look like a mess today, but I really, really have a massive cold and my eyes are watering constantly, so I look like I don't know what. Your hair looks nice though. <laughs> now, you <can laughs> nice. <laughs> now you can see it's changed from this color, from green color. Mm. Yeah, so. <laughs> Getting ready for some uh, huge concert here. Not really sure what's going on though. A lot of noise coming from the speakers for some reason. Uh -huh. We're just walking around and around and around. <laughs> Not exactly sure <laughs> where the center of the town is, or if we, even if there is a center of the city here. But uh, we're just walking around, seeing what we see. So uh, there's 1.7 million people that live here in Almaty. It's quite a big city, really. Actually, the biggest city in Kazakhstan. I see. There's no other city in Kazakhstan that's over 1 million people, so this is the biggest city. Even though not the capital though. But, uh, we'll carry on walking around, see what we can find. But, uh, the city here did actually used to be the capital city a few years ago, until it was moved to uh, Astana. But uh, yeah, it was just a big city. Here in Almaty it's a little bit like being in Denmark. People obey the traffic lights here on the pedestrian crossings. Like we do in other countries, just walk over. Here they actually stand away, just like they're doing in Denmark. by a Danish company called Compain. This is the opera and ballet. <laughs> right in the heart of Almaty, there's a pub called the Old English the Shakespeare pub. Wow, and tonight it's curry night. Couldn't be better. Exactly what I read on Google. <laughs> it's playing on football, and this is an English pub, and it's very good. And you can hear everyone are talking English. Yeah. Not a single one talk, not English. Everyone talking English. Yeah, it's just like being in, in England here. Between ourselves and the winner of the Okay, great place. If you order a curry, you get free beer. <laughs> Can't be better. And, uh, sounds a bit strange we're ordering curry two days before we go to New Delhi, but that's the way it is. Sounds like fun, so we'll give it a try. Just a real shame that these two beers are free when you order a curry. <laughs> we have to pay if you want water, then we have to pay for it. That's a shame. <laughs> yeah, I might just run in, indulge in some Western luxuries while we've got the chance, because soon we won't have the chance again. Hello to Lina, Susanna and Helle, here in the English pub in Kazakhstan, they're actually playing play dudes. Very funny. Okay, so that was...
towards the end of a day here in Almaty. Uh, spent the morning just uh, packing the bikes away in boxes, so we're uh, trying to cram them in. So we uh, took some time, but uh, we managed to strip them down and get them in the boxes. So uh, so they're ready now. Just have to get them taped up tomorrow, and they're ready to go. And then. Uh, this afternoon, just uh, having a walk around the, the city, just having a look around, see what we can find. But also uh, indulging in some Western luxuries while we have the chance with uh, coffee and cake in Starbucks and uh, curry night in the English pub. <laughs> so <laughs> you have to do what you have to do while you've got the chance because all of a sudden we won't find anything like that again. So yeah, we made the most of that. So that was good. But uh, yeah, tomorrow we're here again, but uh, not doing too much tomorrow, just taking it easy here, not that we're going to go anywhere. Just have a rest, because uh, Friday morning we have to get up very early and uh, fly to New Delhi, so... So, okay, that's uh, it for today. I'm we'll, uh, not sure whether I'll make a video tomorrow, because not much is going on, so... May see you tomorrow, or may see you in uh, India. Okay, good night. Bye.